Welcome back. In this video, I will discuss Tomac Link's algorithm for handling imbalanced data. This is one of the undersampling technique for handling imbalanced data in machine learning. I have already discussed what are balanced and imbalanced data sets. Also, I have discussed what are the problems we will face when we have imbalanced data set in machine learning. Also, I have discussed few of the techniques to handle imbalanced data sets. The link for those videos is given in the description below. In this video, I will discuss Tomac links for handling imbalanced data in machine learning. Tomac links are a pair of closed instances that belong to different classes. Let us say that we have been given a data set. Out of that particular data set, uh, one class is majority class, another one is the minority class here. That is the reason the data set is called as imbalanced data set here. Now, what we need to do is uh, we need to identify a pair of very close instances. Those samples are near the borderline between the classes. Once you identify those particular instances, we will go on removing an instance from the majority class from that particular pair here so that we will reduce the number of examples from the majority class so that we can move towards what we can say that balancing that particular data set here. Now the question in front of us is how can we identify those particular tomat links and then how to delete that particular example over here. Now for that reason we need to use this particular rule. Let us say that we say A and B are the close pair of examples if A is nearest to B and B is nearest to A. A and B are near to one another and A and B belong to different classes. That is A belongs to class of minority examples, B belongs to majority class or A belongs to majority and B belongs to minority, whatever it may be. A and B should belong to different classes here. In such cases, we say that A and B are very close pair of observations in this case. That is, A should be near to B, B should be near to A, and A and B should belong to different classes here. If that is the case, A and B are called as, we can say that the close pair observation and an observation from the majority class will be deleted here. So that can be shown with a simple diagram, something like this. This is the original diagram. In this case, uh, the one which is shown in blue color is the majority class here. The one which is shown in orange color is having the minority class here. Now what we do is uh, from this particular data set, we will go on identifying the pair of examples. They are close to each other. So in this case, you can see here, these are very close to each other and they belong to different classes. These two are very close to each other and they belong to different classes. These two are close to each other and they belong to different classes. And the same thing is done for all the examples if they satisfy those two requirement. Once you identify these particular uh, Tomac links, what we need to do? We need to remove an example from these Tomac links, which is from majority class. So between these two, this is from majority class, this will be deleted here. And this will be deleted, this will be deleted, and the same thing will be done for all these particular Tomac links. So once you perform this particular thing, you will be getting the new data set, something like this. And if you observe this and the original data set, this one is more balanced compared to original data set here. The meaning of this one is after identifying the Tomac links and removing these particular examples from the majority class, somehow we get the balanced data set over here. It may not be perfect balanced one, but we will get, uh, we can say that somehow the balanced data set over here. 